what's happening guys so this is going to be a quick video because uh, I want to speak on what Frank Warren said um, this is a quote that he apparently has said, has said and I'm just I thought I might as well just make a quick video talking about it um, he's saying because obviously he was sat next to Neymar last night for the uh, for the fight for the boxing fight in Saudi Arabia and he's making out that you know Arsenal would need Neymar at Arsenal and I'm just making this video to basically say no thanks like don't want him I don't feel we need him and the reason why I'm saying that is because when we would actually need Neymar he'd be injured I, I can't do with another player that we've seen do things at other clubs come in here and just basically end up being a cripple and then you, you, you're just not the same player anymore. I mean, we know, we know in February this guy always skips the Champions League anyway. He always skips. And why would we need that at Arsenal, knowing how important it is for us to make sure everybody's fit so we can actually try and achieve something? Now, I don't have time for that. I don't have time for... The, I'm not saying he's not a good player. He's a good player. No, I, I say no. Well, no, Frank's gassed because Frank would want a, want a player of that calibre at Arsenal. But as much, as nice as it would be, the consistency won't be there in terms of him staying fit. And I can't do that. Can't be asked for that. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, and he, he, his injury record, I don't think it's is is showing. Um, it ain't showing it's it, it's the best. So I don't want injury prone players coming to, to Arsenal. Oh. <laughs> I don't know what the deal is. I mean, I don't know. You guys will think differently. Which, you know, I'm not going to... I'm not going to go against anybody if they take him. I understand why people would take him. But I'm looking at the bigger picture as to why I won't take him at Arsenal. Why I would say no thanks. Why I'm saying I'll pass. I'll pass on Neymar. You know what I mean, I'll, I'll pass comfortably. You know what I mean, some people look at it and say, "Well, you can't really say that because you haven't achieved at the highest level for over twenty years." So, a player who has achieved at the highest level, why would you say no to? From the outside looking in, that's logical. But I'm looking at it from the point of I know how things work when when players like that come to Arsenal. Players that have done things at other clubs. By the time we get our hands on them, they end up being a cripple. Look at Gabriel Jesus. Although I predicted and I knew he'd be a Brazilian Welbeck, right? Even though he's actually worse now. As soon as he got injured, that's it. I knew that's it. He's not going to be the same anymore. Because he was beating it for us before then. As soon as, soon as he got that injury, that's it. History. But let me know what you guys think. Are you guys with Frank Warren? Is Frank Warren begging it? Because Frank Warren's an Arsenal fan, for those of you who didn't know. Um, he's the boxing promoter. He's an Arsenal fan. Um, but I saw AFTV post it. So that's what prompted me to make this video. And plus, you know, I've got scenes out here. Don't you? This is the view. I mean... I'm going to go in the pool now and uh, chill out. Um, the reaction that I'm going to do to uh, Lee Gunner and Judge Moore and Hassam, <laughs> that's coming when I'm back from holiday. I'm back tomorrow, so I'll probably, if I don't do it live, I'll do the reaction tomorrow and then post it um, on my channel. But yeah, it's, um, I agree with Lee on things in that debate and there's a part where it's like fam I can't defend this now like because as I said I'm on the same page as Lee gonna about most of the things basically but there's some things that were said where it's like I can't defend it but let me know what you guys think like the video share the video comment subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next one peace